hi everybody um, I've been getting a lot of messages from the guides and angels and so I've been getting a, like a music sent I got American Pie the song American Pie Bye Bye American Pie which it could indicate um, something to do with the uh, American government or um, New York uh, coming in something that uh, an establishment that is uh, going by the wayside and something new is being brought in also American Pie it's uh, like um, um, this is this will be this is a good day to die or um, this will be the day to, that I die uh, is it came through too and I'm like uh, I don't know if, if there's somebody who has uh, feelings of suicide or suicidal tendis, tendencies or um, thoughts of suicide or there's energies of despair and hope right now um, I know it's a hard time for a lot of people uh, like if you are at all into astrology the aspects are very um, uh, the harsh um, strong energies and emotions are running high people there's a lot lots of tension it brings a lot of tension between different people um, so, um, I got that song was really strong. I also was, uh, woken from my sleep last week and a very strong message. And I, I haven't been getting very many messages. I've been kind of shut off because of a lot of stuff that's going on in my personal life. So I, um, haven't been doing any like work with my guides or any anything to do with cards or fire scrying and um, so I was really surprised because I haven't been remembering my dreams or anything like that I was woken out of my sleep and it was the message was strong it said they are coming so I was uh, I better get out and get ready that's kind of <laughs> the um, message the feeling I got um, it was kind of, um, it wasn't so much ominous, but it was, gave me a little bit of an anxious feel, like um, I didn't know what was coming. So it could be they as a group, collective, or it could be they as them, that person is coming. So I'm not sure that's all about either so <laughs> anyway so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a scry I did uh, I did uh, smudge and all that earlier um, been contemplating on this um, and so I'm gonna go ahead and call in the guides spirit guides and guardian angels Archangel Michael I always call in for protection surround me surround us in the energy of protection white light bring in wisdom and guidance through this scry so that I can discern correctly what messages that will come through we want to know what I guess uh, collectively what is is taking place in, I don't like to put a timeline on it, but what is taking place in the collective now that is bringing tensions and how can we resolve these tensions we have within us and with other people? Like, what is it that we need to know? What's your advice to resolve what is coming forward? To us and if there's any messages for the collective um, like worldwide that we should know is there something we need to know 
as far as uh, world events and maybe some guidance on that. Okay, thank you. First impression I got was pointing fingers. So there's a lot of pointing fingers, pointing blame. Um, nobody's claiming responsibility. That's kind of what I'm getting. Something to do with the hijab, uh, that type of um, culture is coming up. Was Pakistani or something? Something to do with Pakistan is coming through. Something specifically Pakistan women. Something to do with Pakistan women. Um, I'm getting the Mother Mary, the feminine energy is coming through. A feminine spiritual energy is coming through from the other side. Um, prayer, something to do with the mother and child is coming through. I'm getting a fire. I see a fire. It's going to burn really black, really hot, black smoke. Could be like uh, rubber tires, something like that, maybe. It burns really black, anyway. Uh, something to do with pipes, also, is coming through. I'm getting um, there's a lot of psychic energy um, people are picking up or they're actually waking up and they it's mediumship energy they're and it seems like young people they're actually able to discern what spirit says on the other side very healing like young people are like they're becoming healers naturally it's saying listen to the young people they're bringing wisdom like it's from that mother mother energy from the other side is sending messages to these children but it's like healing you're being taught how to heal it's so weird <laughs> uh, some kind of an animal um, some kind of a I'm going to say a sloth it's kind of funny because my daughter and uh, her friend were talking about that today but it looks like that is what's coming through something to do with the sloth or an animal that we're just discovering. It's very odd looking. Dark, oh, dark face. It could be an owl, a, sp a specific type of owl. 
dark face, lighter body. Just like this rod. There's something to do with a drug, drug, drugs, war on drugs, something like that. It's surrounding a fire. So there may be a large fire connected to something. I see like a crack pipe or something like that. That might uncover something. When all is said and done, something may be uncovered from this fire. I feel like there's, for some reason, a lot of spirits wanting to be released. But released from what? It's, it's like lower energy, like in the earth, there's spirits that want to be released. It's kind of weird. Where there's fire, it's, I mean, it's like out of, Out of a, a movie, fire and brimstone, and spirits want to be released from that. I don't know, it's kind of creepy. I'm seeing I'm seeing a man but he's got his hair is part in the middle but it only goes to here like it's cut short he looks to me like an athlete I can't really tell what he's what he's doing I get the impression that there's a lot of spiritual, like, well, if you're Christian, like saints or passed over loved ones, uh, but they're watching. We got, um, they're watching, they're watching us. I don't know if it's for protection or what, but they're watching. And I'm getting the message, they are coming. So whatever they are, these spirits are there watching or protecting, praying on the other side. Like I can see a halo around. I'm getting like the mother energy here. If you can see, see that mother energy right there. Mother energy right there. And 
you next week. Feel like they're young or small spirits of children it feels like it's like the most Bunch of children coming forth through spirit. Yeah. It's like they're watching though. Yeah, they're watching. I'm getting clearly a spirit of a man coming through. Um Possibly passing over or just passed. Hmm. He's definitely passed over, but is it just passing coming through or it's showing that this guy is passing right now? It's hard for me to get the picture. Might be a message for somebody that they've arrived on the other side. He may have had a cleft palate at one time. Something to do with the brain, like a small brain, deteriorated brain, Alzheimer's possibly. nose is bulbous I don't know what you call it but it's it's got it's round I'll show you the picture get it I, I don't have my camera there's the face if it looks familiar to anybody it's the spirit that's come through I believe it has to do with uh, somebody who had Alzheimer's or possibly a tumor behind their eye. There's other spirits there with some, another man and possibly a child. So what? And there is a, there's definitely another spirit with them. Let's see. I think that's 
pretty much all I can see out of this. So it really didn't tell me anything about world events or unless this could be Donald Trump, but no, he's good. No, that's, that doesn't look like Donald Trump to me. It could be somebody in American politics, maybe? One of the politicians passing away or passed away. Doesn't look like Donald Trump to me, so I don't know why I got the name. It popped into my head, but that's I don't know. I don't even look at his picture, so I can't really tell you, but I don't think it's him. Hmm. Looks to me like there is. Something to do with the astronaut, this man. Might have been an astronaut and he's passing away or, or he passed away. You'll hear, hear about him. He's carrying a, like a tablet. Like a stone tablet kind of thing. Something's written in stone. Yeah, I guess something's written in stone and uh, I guess it can't be changed. I don't know. I guess that's all I can see. But Yes, that's it that's all I can get for the reading so I'm glad that you stopped by um, I haven't done them in a while I'm set up here in my office again I'm back here for however long I'm back here for I tend to move around quite a bit but I would like to be able to um, I did put up my maps and I've uh, collected a few more maps like to start doing my pendulums uh, we will pick out a part of the world with the pendulum and then do a scrying session to see what comes through all right well thank you again and i hope to see you soon bye